News 8 at 6 continues. Well, you expect to see geese at mm -hmm. parks, but not inside a home. And not wearing a diaper, and not <laughs> as a pet. But no. that's one local family story, and Matt Malloy has more. Yeah. Spruce isn't your average goose. You're so distinguished. Yes, you are. John Murtari and his son Dominic like to raise animals during the summer. We had a chance to get a fertile goose egg from a local farmer who kept geese, and we thought, let's try it. Now six weeks old, Spruce is their pet goose. He follows us right around, tap, 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 tap. You'll hear him tapping with his little webbed feet. Um, right behind you. Raised from birth by John and Dominic, Spruce isn't fond of other geese. In fact, he thinks he's human. He's people. We're people. He's people. We're his parents. He recognizes us. He recognizes even you guys as people. Sprucey, we're in here in the kitchen. Wherever John and Dominic go, Spruce the goose must follow. When they disappear, Spruce calls out for them. The family realized that Spruce was so attached to them that he wanted to be in the house at all times. And then came the diaper. Get excited. It's, it's diaper time. You can only clean up so much goose poop, you know, by hand, and it gets a little annoying. Come on. That's a good goose. Yes, yes, it's your diaper. John admits some might find this relationship a little unusual. But he says the goose is part of their gaggle. We've had some family picnics and stuff, and, and people just laugh their heads off. In Lyons, Matt Malloy, News 8. John says Bruce will grow to be about 30 pounds. They hope to eventually find a farm to take him to so he'll have more freedom to roam. Now, Maureen, you are looking for a puppy. How about a goose? <laughs> I don't know about the diaper thing. I don't, I don't know either, but it would but save a lot of work. But Spruce seems to be a great little pet. Quacking all day long.